States' rights. Do you believe that states' rights, as described in the Tenth Amendment of the United States Constitution, trump the federal government's control of our straight state? If so, why and how would you enforce this? Well, first of all, the Tenth Amendment is there, Nancy, for a reason. And we need a government that will stand up for the rights of the citizens in their own state. We're seeing that now in Arizona. We need to do things that defend our own state constitution. It, there's an issue called sovereignty. It means that states have independence, too, to issue their own laws and to do things where the federal constitution is silent. The provision of the Tenth Amendment is important to me. You know, I, I want to say it is so important with regard to Obamacare. I asked Governor Lynch through a press release I did when I put an analysis together for governors to stand up for our sovereignty here, to fight the implementation of this unfunded mandate in this horrible bill that's going to hurt our future generation. $1.2 billion impact over 10 years to the state budget alone because of the increase in Medicaid costs. The, the disproportionate share of Medicaid dollars that we're going to lose. And so the federal government has just, through the Obamacare, put down cost shifting to our state $1.2 billion. One of my first acts as governor is to make sure we join, and we're the 23rd state to join that lawsuit. And you know what? If my attorney general doesn't do it, and this is how strongly I feel about this and defending our 10th Amendment, I will make sure that counsel in the governor's office does it. Because we're going to represent the people of this great state. Thank you.